this DIY, you're going to need two of this decorative mesh red from the Dollar Tree, two of the white with the red stripe decorative mesh from the Dollar Tree, two rolls of the nine foot red heart ribbon from the Dollar Tree, some scissors, this wire mesh from the Dollar Tree, and this love is all you need sign from the Dollar Tree, and some red pop cleaners. I got these on Amazon. I buy them in bulk because I use a lot of them. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is get your pop cleaners. You want to go ahead and get quite a few, and you want to cut them in half, just like that. Just like that, so you have a stack. You're going to use these in putting together your wreath. So I got a nice big stack going. Start me off. Alright, so I got a stack of that. The first thing you want to do is get this sign. And you want to use your pie cleaners. And Attach this sign to your wreath in a few places. I'm going to loop it around this so that it will stay. Okay. okay. And then you want to attach this side as well to your pipe cleaner, to your wreath, like that. All right. Then the wreath will hang down like, like that, okay? <clears throat> if you'd like the wreath to stay in place, you can put a little bit of hot glue on your wreath, on the back side, to hold the sign down. Like a little bit hot glue right here. Oh, let's put it right here. It did not touch. A little bit of hot glue right here. So your sign will stay in place. Just like that. Okay, so now your sign is attached to your wreath. Then you want to take your red and your white ribbon and put them together. Kind of scrunch them up on the end, like so. This will be hidden in the back, so don't worry about that. And you want to take your wreath and you just want to start. You can start where there's like a break in the, in the wreath. And so you just want to put that down your wreath, just like that. And you want to take one of your pipe cleaners and you want to tie it through. And then you want to twist it as tight as you can, like so. Don't worry about it sticking up. We'll take care of that at the end. Then you want to make a loop, okay? And you want it to be consistent, so you just want to make a loop with both of them about like that. And we're going to tie it right here to the wire. We want to tie it on as tight as we can as well. So we got our first loop going, see? Just like that. Okay, then you wanna make another loop, just like that, about the same size as the last loop. And then you wanna get another pipe cleaner and tie it on 
tight as you can, just like that. And you want to scrunch it up next to the other one, okay? Then you want to get another loop about the same size. You're going to get another pipe cleaner. And you're just going to continue to repeat these steps all the way around your wreath. Okay. okay, so this is the progress we've got going of the wreath. like that. Okay. When you come to a corner with a sign, you're just gonna loop around the sign. Don't worry about it, just keep looping. The sign it'll all be hidden when we're done. Heading around the sign, just like that. And you want these to be sticking out like this. Don't worry about them sticking out and you can see them as you're doing your wreath. I'll show you at the end why we want to do that. We're going to stick a ribbon in it and use that tie, and then we'll cut off any the excess that you see. Okay, so just keep going around.
take your ribbon and you want to do the same thing. You want to pinch the end and you want to use the pipe cleaners that are already in there and twist it around the ribbon to hold it in place. Like that. Then you just want to loop the ribbon like that. And then you want to tie it to that pipe cleaner. Okay. So it's going to look like that. And then you're going to Continue on around. And if you wanted, you could put a bow over here, but you wouldn't have to. It's really up to you. If you wanted to add a bow, you could just loop. And then loop. And then loop again. And then loop again, and loop again, and loop again, and then cut off a piece. And then you can get <clears throat> a small piece and tie a knot. in it, just like that. Then, you separate the loops to make a bow. And then you use these two small ones to attach wherever you want your bow. There we go. And then bring these long strands down. Fluff out your bow. Just like that. And then have these straight down into your wreath. And then you can cut these off. You just pinch them together. And then you cut up the ribbon.
There you have your finished wreath.